going on? What is all this? Are you okay? I... I have no idea. Who are you? Jesse! Jesse! Where are you? Say something, Jesse! We're coming! No way, no way! You found Gabriel? Who's Gabriel? We need to get out of here now! This way! Jesse! You made it! And... Gabriel? Did you say Gabriel? Look out! Those Endermen are running the wrong way! They'll be killed! Soren? I can't stand by and watch! Stop staring and get a move on! Well, I can't just abandon them, not after a lifetime of study. Your head's gonna be abandoning your body if you don't turn around and run! <laughs> Jesse! They're falling behind! Axel, you gotta move faster! She's too sick. This is the best we can do. They're not going to be able to outrun it. Not on foot. We got to find a way to move faster. We're all going to be caught in the tractor beam. We need transportation. Anyone seen a mine cart? I think Axel still has one from the nether, but it won't help. We need to lay down too much track. We'll have to use the next best thing. Everybody, get on! We got this. We'll take the reins, and they can just hang on. I've got Petra! Then I'll take Gabriel. Hold on, this might be a bumpy ride. Horses! Whatever you do, don't look back. Ah! I looked. Everyone, follow me! <laughs> Jesse, look out! Ah, this is awesome! Axel, stop backseat steering! I can't help it. I'm getting horse sick. It's gaining on us! No offense, but you could use a little practice. First time on a horse here! Watch it! You trying to knock me off this thing, Jesse? Sorry. this thing, Jesse? Sorry. I turn around to see if it's gaining, but it's all I can do to hold on. <gasps> We need to ride over that. 
Archie, look out! Enderman! They're slowing it down! Am I seeing Enderman attack the Wither Storm? Enderman move blocks. It's what they do. Guys, come on! We gotta build a new one, like right now. Come on, faster! We need more blocks. I got some. Yeehaw! Woo! Oh, Axel, you're screaming in my ear. Sorry. We made it. We actually freaking made it. Jesse, Gabriel was saying some pretty weird stuff back on that horse. He might have wither sickness. I don't know. You never acted the way he's been acting. I'll go talk to him. Hey, how are you feeling? I, I'm afraid I don't feel much like myself at the moment. Gabriel, it really is you. They told us you'd kicked it. <sighs> Who are you people? It's me, Magnus. Old friend, don't you recognize us? It's Soren. We've known each other for a very long time. The Wither Storm did something to him. You mean that thing we just rode on? No, that was a horse. <sighs> what a terrible turn of events. You, you're the one who rescued me. Tell me, please, what is going on? I remember only blackness. And then, suddenly you were there. You were caught in the Witherstorm, trapped. For how long? Long enough that it did this to you. It felt like an eternity. It was dark and foul, and I was sure I was a goner. Well, you aren't. You made it back alive which is more than I can say for some of us. Oh, man. Ellie. For a second, I almost managed to forget. You guys talking about Eligard? I just can't believe she's gone. Doesn't feel real. How? How could this have happened? To lose not just a friend. Guys, it was my fault. I'm the one who took Eligard's armor. But you couldn't have known what was going to happen. She's right. Don't blame yourself, kid. I, uh, never blame myself for anything. Ma! Ah! Being emotional is getting us nowhere! What I want to know is, what happened out there today? Why is that thing still alive? My instructions were simple. You were the one in the middle of everything. What went wrong? All we managed to do is make things worse. The command block is still out there, Soren. Blast! And now, to make matters worse, we've gone from one wither storm to three! Our plan was a total failure! I should have cast the foul thing into the abyss. Why didn't I destroy that cursed block ages ago? So, is the command block controlling all three wither storms? Uh, why are you asking me? Am I expected to know every last thing in the universe? Uh, I need a moment to think. Is he always like this? <laughs> you have no idea. That jacket! I recognize it! Lucas always wears that jacket. No. There were other people wearing that very same jacket when I was thrown from the monster! Ugh. It hurts just to think about. Hey, hey! It's okay! Jesse, if what Gabriel said is true... I mean, do you think? Lucas, your friends could still be out there! I know, and that means I... I gotta go after them. They might need me, Jesse. Whoa. I suddenly feel...
really dizzy. Easy, easy. I gotcha. Petra, how are you doing? You feeling any better? Better is relative. If I just sit here and don't move or breathe, it's almost bearable. Man, if it wasn't for Ivor, she wouldn't even be like this. Ah, no kidding. That's not exactly true. Ivor built the Wither, sure, but he couldn't have done it without that skull I gave him. If I'd just taken a second to think about it. There's no way you could have known what would happen. No one's ever seen anything like this. Still, I'm gonna do everything I can to make this right. Petra, I know this isn't easy to hear, but you're too sick to be going anywhere. I'm not that sick. Maybe you should rest in this cave for a while. I mean, it's safe, defensible. If I say I'm fine, then I'm <coughs> fine. If you try to keep going, I'm afraid you're not gonna make it. Petra, you need to keep fighting. There's no time to sit around relaxing in some cave. Jesse. Thanks, Jesse. Knew you'd understand. Just give me a little time to catch my breath, and I'll be fine. This is a bad idea, Jesse. Yeah, well, it's Petra's call to make. Gravel? No. Dirt? <sighs> Don't think so. <sighs> hey, buddy. You doing okay? <laughs> of course you are. Wish I could say the same for everyone else. Some leftover cobblestone might come in handy. Lucas, what are you doing? I told you, I'm going after my friends. I thought the other ocelots were dead. But if they're not, I need to go find them. Look, I am grateful to you guys for bringing me this far. You're right, they do need you. The best way to help them is to help us beat that monster. That sounds right, but it just doesn't feel right, Jesse. But Lucas... Look, you and me, we've made a pretty good team so far. I'd even call us friends. So I hope you'll understand why I need to go help my old friends. They do it for me. I can't believe I'm saying this, but... If your heart's telling you to go, then you gotta go. Otherwise, you'd be heartless or something. <laughs> Thank you, Jesse. I'll find them, and then I'll find you again, too. I promise. Thanks. I'm not gonna lie, man, but we've pulled through worse, right? Have we? How's it going? Tell me, Jesse, who is this person? He keeps insulting me. One minute I think I'm talking to a friend. That right there is Magnus. Everyone knows Magnus. Magnus? Hmm. And how do I know him exactly? I sense we have a history, but... He's your friend. He's been your friend for a very long time. Really? Really? You go way back. It isn't working. He doesn't remember. Talk to him about your past. Something only you would know about. Like what? It's been so long since we've seen each other. Talk about fighting the Ender Dragon. No, oh, no, no, no. Anything but that. Come on, it's what you're famous for. <sighs> well, all right then. The Ender Dragon. You see, it was huge. And dangerous. And for a while there, it looked like we were goners. But you know who stepped in and killed that thing? Um, was it Jesse? Huh? No! It was you, man! You killed it! Oh. Thank you for sharing that with me. And Jesse, thank you too. You've been a big help here. I, uh... I need to repay your kindness. I'm not sure how exactly. It's no problem. I'd have done it for anyone. 
All the same, you have my thanks. Now then, tell me more about this Ender Dragon. Man, I don't even know where to begin. <laughs> Sorry, Reuben. I don't really feel like company. Reuben! Understand? <laughs> yeah, I know you've run off before, but things are different now. We've lost too many people already. The world needs us, Reuben. So much of it has already been reduced to bedrock, and it's up to us to save the rest of it. <laughs> well, maybe that is a lot of pressure for just a person and a pig, but we have to find a way. That's what I said. It's about the future. There are three of those things now. You say that like it's my fault. It is your fault. Oh, take responsibility for once, Soren. I did that by luck. Soren, you need to listen to me. Oh, what good has ever come of that? What are you doing here, Ivor? Come to lock me in another room? I came to offer my help. Ha! He's been following us. It's not like that. You need to hear me out. What you don't understand is, you are all in very grave danger. <laughs> Obviously! No, I mean specifically this group. The Witherstorm isn't acting randomly. It's following Gabriel. Gabriel? You see, I may have programmed it to follow his amulet. You mean, the Order's amulet? Yes, Soren. That amulet. Oh, don't be so dramatic. Did you also know I was the one he gave the amulet to? What? I... I didn't know. Ah, <sighs> Ivor, you fool. You've created a monster that's following Jesse, and it's only getting stronger. You don't think I realize that? Nothing can stop those things. Nothing even hurts them. Well, except Enderman. Enderman? Jesse's right. The Withers' gaze passed over them, and they went wild. Soren, do you think Enderman could actually destroy one of those things? Well, it's not beyond imagination. If there were enough of them working together, it's a promising concept, at least in theory. Could you coordinate the Endermen somehow? Make them attack all at once? If I know my Endermen, all we'd need to do is get them into the storm's vicinity. In fact, there's probably more than enough of them still in my fortress. An unintended side effect of you flooding the end. This is just like the old days, Soren. You and your crazy ideas- Hush, Ivor, for once! Huh. Question is, how to bring the storms and the Endermen together? Endermen aren't pets. They don't follow orders. At least, not from mere mortals. The Witherstorms are already chasing us. If we just get them to chase us to your fortress again... Yes! Yes, that's it! They'll be caught between a rock and a hard place! If we can't bring the Endermen to the Witherstorms, we bring the Witherstorms to the Endermen. Just one problem. You're forgetting about the command block! Ugh, oh, yes. It's clear now that no weapon can destroy it. Not even a formidable. Actually, I may have a solution to that. You see, when I first took possession of the command block... You mean, stole it? Yes, well, I created a failsafe. A backup plan, for just in case. Well, I'd say just in case is here. What kind of failsafe exactly? An enchanting book. One that contains the power of the command block itself. Use it to enchant a weapon. 
and you'll be able to smash the command block to bits. Forever! Yes. Yes, that's it. It could very well solve all our problems. What are we waiting for? Let's go get that book. Just one problem. It's at my secret lab, which is sort of far away. How far could it possibly be? Let's just say it's the farthest place a person can travel before being utterly... Oh dear, what was that? I can't believe it found us so quickly. It just keeps coming for us. Well, we can't stand around and wait for it. Guys, I have a plan. We're going to Ivor's secret laboratory to try to craft a... Ivor! It is you! Good to see you too, Magnus. Hello. My name is Gabriel. Somebody pinch me. Anyway, Ivor's figured out that Witherstorms are drawn to the amulet, so we're gonna lure them back to Soren's fortress and destroy the command block with an enchanted super weapon. You figured all that out just now? The point is we need to get moving. We aren't safe. Not as long as we have that amulet. I'll take it. You can't. I can, and I have to. There's no way I can let you do that, Axel. You don't understand. I'm not asking. I thought you'd trust me by now. You just go make that super weapon. I'll meet you back at Soren's fortress. Well, Axel shouldn't have to do this alone. I'm coming with you, man. Nice. Jesse, I'm going with him, too. Like you said, I need to keep fighting. Well, I'm going with Jesse. I pledge to help, and that's what I must do. But Lucas is out there all by himself. There's nothing you can do for him now. Everyone, take good care of yourselves. You too. Hey, Jesse. Let's try our handshake again, just once for the road. The warrior's whip? You got it. <laughs> I'll see you at Soren's, all right? Not if I see you first. Almost there. Much further now.
No, 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 we are not there yet. is profoundly sore. Feels like we've been riding forever. I am telling you, we cannot go to the Far Lands. They're not just the edge of our world, but the limits of our comprehension. Oh, please. The Far Lands are a happy accident. Nature's way of keeping life interesting. No, no, no. They are perilous and unpredictable. Perlin noise, floating points. These are not matters to be toyed with. You know, I think I've heard of the Far Lands before. I'd be surprised if you hadn't. The Far Lands lie at the very edge of all things, where logic gives way to chaos. They're a dangerous place to visit, and a ridiculous place to construct a laboratory. <laughs> Just wait until you see it. Do those two never stop arguing? I don't know. I'm too hungry to care. No kidding. I'm starving. Maybe we should turn back? This isn't the time. Swamps are too dangerous. You never know what might be lurking around. What was that? My stomach. Let's look around, see what we could find out. We mustn't linger long. The Far Lands are just beyond this swamp. So this could be our last chance to find food? <laughs> Potato, you're coming with me. Not much, but it'll help. Like they say, two potatoes is better than one. I think they say that. Hey, Jesse, have you found any food? I should probably take what I have back to the group. should steer clear of it. Nothing good ever happens when witches are involved. Look, a cake! That's, that's enough to feed everyone! It isn't worth it, Jesse. Witches hate trespassers. Besides, there are plenty of potatoes around. Is that a witch? <laughs> Jesse, we shouldn't be here. Witches are very strong. Let's get out of here. Good idea. Guys! Jesse, did you find any food? Actually, yeah, some potatoes, but it'll have to wait. There's a witch nearby. We saw her creeping through the swamp. <laughs> She's here! <laughs> oh no, you don't. Watch out for her potions. Skeletons? That's a deadly combination. Her potions combined with their arrows? Oh, we'll all be killed. The Far Lands are just past the swamp. But they've seen us. They'll just follow us. The rest of you, go! I'll hold them off. What? Ivor, no! There's no time to argue. Just head for the corner of the glitch wall. The what wall? Hey, you witch! You're not the only one who can throw a potion. Come on! Hold on to your potatoes!
Guys, I think we lost them for... Wow! You lost them for wow? What is that? Oh, wow. It's like we're at the edge of the world. Actually, we seem to be at the corner of it. Welcome to the Far Lands, my friend. I'd feel a lot better about going into this crazy wall thingy if I wasn't still hungry. Well, at least Jesse found those potatoes. That might be the saddest sentence ever uttered. <laughs> Quite a sight, isn't it? Stretching skyward in all its glory, like a monument to chaos itself. This wall? Did Ivor build this? No, of course not. This is a natural phenomenon. The intersection of two of the great walls that form the boundary of our world. Incredible. You can say that again. Incredible. How can Ivor live here? I mean, it's one thing to build a wool world inside the end, but this... Oh, I doubt he lives here. He most likely comes here only for his most secretive research. Whatever Ivor is hiding in here, it will be extremely well guarded. This way, I suspect. I'd feel better about this if the rest of our group was with us. Come on! Would appear so. A massive one from the looks of it. If Ivor used the command block to build this, it could hold unspeakable peril. Why do I sense that entering this so-called maze would be a grave mistake? Because some part of you still knows Ivor. Unfortunately, this seems to be the only way forward. There has to be another way. A secret door, or I don't know. There's no way we're going into some crazy maze that Ivor built to keep people away. We'll find some other way through. Best decision you've made all day. Ivor needs to take better care of this place. Well, that worked, I suppose. Yeah, I guess. But now what do we do? We're all separated. Let's just head that way and find a place where the pads connect. Sure hope they don't get lost in there. I hope I don't get lost in there.
I first met Ruben in the water fall like this. Hope the little guy's okay. I think it's safe to say the far lands are strange. Yikes! Shoot! You have got to be kidding me.
Olivia! <laughs> way across. Huh, redstone blocks, some pistons. I wonder what this thing's supposed to be. Hello? Anyone? Olivia, is that you? Jesse, there you are. <coughs> I thought I'd never find you. Am I glad to see you guys? Us too. I thought Reuben and I would be lost in here forever. <coughs> this maze? We don't have time for this. Who even knows where the others are by now? <coughs> I mean, the clock's ticking here, Jesse. Yet we're lost in some elaborate puzzle. Well, at least we're back together. Yes, the dream team reunited. <coughs> Now the dream team's just got to find a way across this gaping bottomless pit. What about this thing? Could it get us across? It's some kind of flying barge. It would probably get us to the other side. But it's in really bad shape. And it's really complicated. You can fix it though, right? I don't know. I think it's out of my league. I wish I'd had more time to study with Eligard. Come on, you'll figure it out. You know you always do. <sighs> Fine. I'll take a look. This layout doesn't even make any sense. What was Ivor thinking? Or maybe it's just me. I mean, Eligard herself said I don't have what it takes to be a great engineer. She was right, I just can't hack it. I might as well be a carrot farmer. So prove her wrong. Show the world what you're made of. Prove her wrong? Jesse, she was the greatest redstone engineer ever. She was in the Order of the Stone. Sure, but the Order are still people, just like us. Right, just like us. I mean... How are we the ones saving the world when even they don't have what it takes? 
Soren and Ivor are always at each other's throats. The greatest warrior in history doesn't remember his own name. All I ever see Magnus do is argue, and we both know what happened to Eligard. If the Order can't do this, how are we supposed to? How are we supposed to do anything? We're nobody. All I know is the world is depending on us. And maybe the world is in trouble. I mean, they defeated an Ender Dragon. Can you name even one thing we've done right? And I don't mean managing to stay alive. Well, for starters, we're the ones who brought them back together again. You found Eligard, I found Magnus. We both played a role with Soren. Yeah, I suppose that's true. Ah, all right. I'll try it one more time. Wait a second. I think I see what he was trying to do. Jesse, take this piston, craft it into a sticky piston, then place it on the other side of the barge, along with a redstone block. You got all that? I think so. Sooner the better. a redstone block. Okay, let's put the redstone block where it's supposed to go and place these pistons. We did it! We need flint and steel to get it started. I'm proud of you, Olivia. Thanks, Jesse. And thanks for everything you said just before. It really helped. No problemo. It must be this way! Run! Everybody get on! Quick, onto the barge! Jesse! That was close. Everyone okay? For the moment. I remember something. Didn't Eligard build a machine like this once? Yes, in the nether. <clears throat> and you were terrified of flying on it. What? Stuff and nonsense. <laughs> Soren, is that true? Of course not! Ah. <laughs> well, I suppose I might be mistaken. Mm, I liked you better when you had amnesia. Well, that was exciting. Uh, by exciting, I assume you mean absurd and unnecessary. Let's go see what he's hiding in there.
So many books. We should be careful. This place could be booby-trapped. Let's just start looking for the enchanting book. How to train your slime. The various uses of mushroom stew. Potionology, volume 24. None of these are enchanting books. A brief history of cubism. Crafting for noobs, revised. A collector's guide to precious gems. None of these seem to be enchanting books either. How I Learned to Stop Worrying and Love Mining. The Unabridged Redstone Encyclopedia. Zombies and Pigs and Intimate Memoir. I think I'm in the wrong part of the house. Reuben, what are you doing? <coughs> yeah, well, you're gonna get yourself cooked. I've told you before, stay away from lava. Hey, Olivia, I think there's some redstone over here. Looks like a circuit. We probably just need a lever to power it. Too bad I don't have one. Yeah, no lever, no functioning circuit. Makes sense that Ivor would have a crafting table. I'll need a cobblestone and some sticks if I want to craft a lever. Wood planks, those will be useful. First, I'll need some sticks. Okay, got the sticks. There we go, good old fashioned lever. Like it was made for it, which it was. Let's see what this sucker does. build a secret passage in a house that nobody ever visits. More like why wouldn't you? Secret passageways are cool. Good point. What the? Are you guys okay? We're fine, but the lever isn't working anymore. Stay there! We'll head down and see what we can find!
Whoa, what is all this? Ha, huh, incredible. He's gathered them all in one place. Gathered what exactly? The treasures of the Order of the Stone. The stories I could tell about these dusty old things. I don't see any enchanting books, though. Maybe through there? Uh, locked, of course. There must be some way to open it. Now that's pretty bright. Am I crazy or is this a sea lantern? Ah, the very same one the Order built all those years ago. We were so green back then. It looks just as bright as on the day we crafted it. Jesse, what are you doing? Uh, taking this really cool, rare item. We might need it to unlock that door. Uh, very well. Just be careful with it. See? These are prismarine crystals. You can only get these underwater, right? Precisely. We nearly ran out of oxygen getting these. <laughs> Elagard had to use a spare bucket just to grab a few extra breaths. We used most of these to craft a sea lantern. This is all that remained. Prismarine is such a cool word. Prismarine. So where'd this packed ice come from? Well, we brought it back from the Ice Plains Spikes biome. It was colder there than anywhere we'd ever been, but <laughs> Magnus slipped so many times our laughter kept us warm. After that, we knew we were ready to face the Ender Dragon. Ooh, cold and slippery. These gas tears, they're super hard to get. You don't know the half of it. It was our first official mission as the Order of the Stone. We fought those ghasts for hours, and these tears were our reward. Wow. Just gotta borrow this. Soren, is this the actual Ender Dragon egg? Huh. Alas, yes. The only thing that remains of our final adventure together. No way I'm leaving this behind. Why is Ivor hiding a hopper in his basement? Huh, five slots. Gassed tears. So let's try them here. Ender dragon egg, so cool. Let's try it. A sea lantern. In you go. Prismarine crystals. Into the hopper. Huh, those were the right objects, but I guess it was the wrong order. Packed ice. That doesn't look right. Right. 
Guess that wasn't right. what order to put them in. There were 120 possible combinations. It was all in the order's history. The, the order of the order, so to speak. Nice work, Jesse. On the puzzle, I mean, not, not the joke. You know, I often give Ivor a hard time, but for all his complaining, his time with the order clearly meant a great deal to him. Yeah, I guess so. Anyway, let's go get that enchanting book. the stars, the Ender Dragon, with replica Ender Crystals and all. Wow, I always wondered what it looked like. Hmm, no way out. Hmm, interesting. but it isn't doing anything. Bow and arrow, great weapons. Looks like a banner about TNT. That's a sword, well, banner of a sword anyway. That's redstone. Four, but it isn't doing anything. I pressed all four, but it isn't doing anything. Soren, what's this thing supposed to be? It appears to be an homage to our battle with the Ender Dragon. Despite his anger, Ivor never stopped being fond of us. <laughs> he was a big part of our team, after all. We're missing something here, Soren. And I have a feeling the key might be locked in that head of yours. I have a key locked in my head? What I'm saying is, I think you need to tell me about the Ender Dragon battle. Oh, ha. Huh. If only you'd been there. It was a fight for the ages. We'd spent weeks preparing for our greatest battle ever. But even so, Ender Dragon was stronger than even I had imagined. I realized that it was drawing strength from the Ender Crystals, and that the crystals had to be destroyed. I hit the first with a perfectly placed arrow. The second I destroyed by launching myself on the shockwave of Magnus's TNT. Using only my strength and my wiles, I steered the foul beast toward the third crystal.
I flew the dragon directly toward the final pistol. Only then did Gabriel deliver his famous final blow. Yeah. We became heroes, and eventually, legends. The greatest the world has ever known. That was absolutely amazing. They didn't call us the Order of the Stone for nothing. Wonder if that story will help me solve this puzzle. So Soren rode the dragon, huh? Another door? Soren, tell me the- Certainly. We'd spent weeks preparing for our greatest battle. Uh, sorry, maybe the short version this time? Well... All right. I destroyed one crystal with my bow, the next using a TNT shockwave, the third with Eligard's redstone cannon, the fourth from upon the dragon itself. And then Gabriel poked it dead with a sword. How was that? It's better. Thanks. Ruben, do you know what to do here? Uh oh. Uh, well, it was worth a shot. Hey, Ruben, give me a boost, will ya? eye and swore. Soren, you said destroying these crystals was the key to defeating the Ender Dragon. You did kill the Ender Dragon, right? Jesse, this isn't, this isn't what it looks like. Our story, uh, the, the story, it's, it's mostly true. I swear, I swear it. Whatever you're thinking, I promise I can explain. Soren, I want the truth and I want it now. I, I can't. We swore never to speak of it. I don't care. I'm afraid I haven't been honest with you, Jesse. We did defeat the Ender Dragon, but it, it wasn't exactly like I said. 
How not exactly? We got rid of it, but we didn't kill it, per se. In fact, we didn't even fight it. So what did you do to it? We didn't do anything. We used that damned command block. You used the command block to defeat the Ender Dragon? I'm afraid so. Understand. When I found that blasted block, we were nobodies. But with its help, we became stronger. Faster, we could do so much more. The others had no idea what I was doing. Yet the more I used it, the more we came to depend on it. I knew it was only so long before someone would find out. concocted a plan. I would use the command block to blink the Ender Dragon out of existence. <laughs> Securing our status as legends forever. We told the world we defeated a dragon. And the rest is history. Soren, I looked up to you. The whole world did. Nobody is more ashamed than me. So you finally admit it. Soren, how could you? Ivor. How long have you guys been standing there? Long enough that they heard the whole thing. So we're liars. All of us. You didn't think you could keep it secret forever, did you, Soren? The truth hurts, doesn't it? But Ivor... Why? Is this why you left the Order? Because Soren lied? Because they all did. Soren, Gabriel, Magnus, Eligard, they agreed to keep this a secret. How conniving of us. And you, you agreed to stay quiet too, in exchange for all of our treasures. <gasps> I've technically never told anybody. Jesse discovered the truth on his own. So this whole thing, the wither you unleashed, it's all been to teach the Order a lesson? To teach the world a lesson. To show you who the Order really are. Liars, cowards. And now, they know. And how is that any better? You reveal their lies at the expense of the world itself? Look, my wither plan obviously backfired. You think? I didn't know we'd end up with three of those things tearing the world apart. For a moment, I nearly forgot. Well, they are. And while we sit around talking about your dysfunctional order of liars, those things are still out there wrecking the world. Jesse's right. Destroying the command block is all that matters anymore. How ironic that the best thing the command block gave us was the very means to destroy it. Spare us the poetry. It's not your strong suit. I've had this book for years. So the enchanting book, what do we do with it? You craft a weapon, then put it on an anvil. Follow me, I'll show you. Ivor, I'm sorry. About everything. Yes, well, it doesn't matter now. Grab some ingredients and craft a weapon. I'll show you how to enchant it. Sweet. Let's see what Ivor's got in here. Let's see, there's a bunch of crafting stuff and... Diamond score! Can't enchant the weapon until I craft the weapon. So, I can craft whatever I want, huh? An axe. Guess I could crap a pickaxe, a shovel, a hoe.
awesome! I've never owned a diamond weapon! Just wait till you enchant it! Let's see what this enchanting book is made of. Behold! My enchanted diamond sword! Yes, that should do the job nicely. But if you're fighting those wither monsters head on, you'll want better armor too. I enchanted these for the order. They're about as strong as it comes. Even able to withstand TNT. Any preference? I have eight different sets to choose from. All right, let me take a look at them. It's all quite durable. And all right, this is the set. Yes, a fine choice. Now go ahead and put it on. You can take some for your friends as well. Sounds good to me. Wow, cool armor, Jesse. Thanks. And there's plenty to go around. Now let's get back to Soren's fortress and see how the Witherstorms are doing against those Endermen. Or a fortress. I see Endermen, so this means the plan's working, right? Shouldn't the Endermen have dismantled those things by now? Or am I just confused? It's not just you. Something's wrong. Jesse, over here! Axel! Petra, you're okay! You guys made it! Nice freaking arm. Hey, Petra. Are you all right? No, I'm barely hanging on. I should have stayed in that cave. Except you saved my butt like a dozen times. He's exaggerating. I found a couple potions to keep me going. Yeah. Well, the cavalry has arrived. You've done your part. Now it's time for us to do ours. Might not be as easy as you think. The Endermen, they're not angry enough. I mean, some of them are, but a lot of them are just standing around moving blocks. You know, being Enderman. Ah, oh, what? They kept the main wither storm busy, but one of the smaller ones started attacking us. Yeah, so Magnus ran off to fight that thing all by himself. He's fighting a wither storm? Alone? Yep, kept saying something about paying for the mistakes of the past, whatever that means. If a fellow member of the Order of the... of the, uh... Order of the Stone? ...is out there fighting, then I belong out there too. Gabriel, no, no, I told you you're not who you think you are. My name is Gabriel the Warrior. And he's running the wrong way. Oh, for goodness sake. I'm not letting that idiot get himself killed. Gabriel, come back here. <sighs> Without the command block, none of them stands a chance. Say what now? Why do they need the command block? Trust me, you don't want to know. Yeah, I do. No, you don't. Um, okay. <coughs> Jesse, guys, I can't do this anymore. You need to go on without me. What? No. I fought as hard as I could, but... Petra, I shouldn't have pushed you. You needed to rest, and I didn't listen. It's not your fault. I wanted to come. Please, just destroy that command block. For me. Believe me, I will. So what's the plan? I mean, I know we gotta go in there, but... 
we just go for it or what? We need to find a way for me to use this. Whoa, that is, without question, the coolest thing I have ever, ever seen. Me too. Nice, Jesse. Oh, and I brought you some armor, Axel. Here. Nice. I was feeling a little left out. Guys, let's go kick some command block butt. Anyone see the command block? We need to get more Endermen focused on the Wither Storm! How do you make Endermen focus? I can't even make myself focus. We, we shouldn't be here. None of this is going according to plan. Soren, what are you doing? I, uh, you know, I've, I've really enjoyed meeting you all, but... Soren! Did Soren just run away? Soren, you coward, I can't believe you! So much for the mighty Order of the Stone. Doesn't matter, we have work to do. We need to get those Endermen to attack it! The tractor beam! Jesse, that's it! Make them chase you into the tractor beam! How do you like that, you purple-eyed freak? <laughs> yes, they're falling for it. Snowballs? Yeah, I found them near the cave. Here. All right, let's see how you like this. Come and get me. Ruben, can you give me a little help? Ah! Nice one, Ruben. to find you a way up. Or build you a way up. That's it. E everyone, empty your pockets. Let's see. I've got redstone and cobblestone from Ivor's Armory. I have some TNT from Boomtown. I've got pistons, repeaters, some wool, some leftover slime. Oh, and I still have that minecart. That's got to be enough to make something, right? I mean, 
If we use the TNT on, say... The minecart? Or those pistons. And we do have all that cobblestone. Guys, check it out. We build a cobblestone ramp, lay down some track, attach the TNT to the minecart, and launch it off the ramp like a rocket. <laughs> Heck yeah! I love that idea. So what are we waiting for? Let's hurry up and... Oh, look out! I can't hold on. I got you. Lucas, you're here. Basilots, distract that wither storm. Hey, you, get a load of this. Lucas, thank you. Anything for a friend. Now let's hurry up and build this thing. I'm almost out! You guys done yet? Just need a few more seconds. Okay, it's finished. Quick, climb on! And Jesse, I know you can do this. We all do. Thanks, guys. It means a lot. Now go demolish that command block. Ruben, this is no place for a. Have surprised me like that. On the other hand, I'm kind of glad not to be alone right here. Just stay close, okay? Some weapon, don't fail me now. All right. 
great new plan. I'll climb up there and use one of those tentacles to swing toward the command block. Stay here, Reuben. I mean it this time. Beam. Hey, you! Reuben, I'll be fine. Don't let it suck you all the way up. Just close enough and do what I have to do. Bet you can't catch me! down. You. Time to put an end to this thing once and for all. Ruben! Hold on, buddy! Jesse, are you all right? We thought you were... I mean, I didn't think you'd made it. Reuben, where's Reuben? I thought he was with you. Guys, look! My sickness is gone! Oh, Petra, I'm so happy for you. Hey, hey. Do you guys hear something? Reuben! Hero, you know that? You just helped save the world. Come on, Reuben, say something. It's 
okay, boy. I'm here. I'm here. Jesse, I am... I am so sorry. He was a great pig. People used to look at me like that once, Jesse. Having my memory restored has been both a blessing and a curse. Perhaps they deserve to know the truth about the Order. All those lies we told them. Maybe I should finally come clean. Don't tell them, Gabriel. Just let them have their legend. We all owe a great debt to Jesse and his friends. But I owe a debt to you people as well. Which is why, there is something I want to tell you about the Order. We may have defeated the Ender Dragon, but that is nothing compared to what these heroes did. They took down a Witherstorm. They are a new generation of heroes. Thank you, everyone. I know you think I'm up here because I saved the world or something, but the truth is I didn't do it alone. Far from it. You see, I had my friends with me. There was Olivia, Axel, Petra, Lucas. They stood by my side right from the start. Well, and they made fun of me when I deserved it. But that's just how we are. Dang right we are. It's crazy to think my friends and I started out in a treehouse, and now we've been to some of the weirdest places in the world. I mean, come on, we went to the Far Lands. There was this gigantic wall and a huge maze and a model of the Ender Dragon that well, you just had to be there. But when all was said and done, you know what really mattered? My hero, Reuben the Pig, 
He may have seemed like just a pig to most people, but he was so much more. And at the end of the day, he saved us all. For Reuben! Jesse, this is the nether star that dropped when the wither storm was destroyed. You want to do the honors? Oh man, this is going to be so cool. to introduce to you the new Order of the Stone. And so it was that a new Order of the Stone was born. One whose adventures were only just beginning. For though the world had been saved and the command block destroyed, there are many more worlds than just this one.